The stitches for rounds 17 to 18 are the same. In rounds 17 to 18, with one chain stitch, nine single crochets, and one slip stitch for each round. Great yarn over the hook and pull the yarn through the loop on the hook. The yarn chain is done. That's one chain stitch. Pull the off white yarn tights. Then what nice single crochets. Finally, put one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 17 is done. Please finish round 18 in the same way as round 17, with one chain stitch, 9 single crochets and one slip stitch in turn. Round 18 is done. In round 19, change to yarn, and then work one chain stitch, nine single crochets, and one slip stitch. Release the gray yarn. Change to out white yarn, and then work one chain stitch. One chain stitch is finished, and the yarn change is done. Then work 9 single crochets. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 19 is done. Please finish round 20 in the same way as round 19, but one chain stitch, nine single crochets, and one slip stitch in turn.
Round 20 is done. In rounds 21 to 40, work 2 rounds with black yarn first, and change to white yarn to work the next 2 rounds, then change to black yarn to work the next 2 rounds. We need to change the yarn every 2 rounds. Please keep crocheting according to this rule until round 40 is done. Round 40 is done. Now, we need to change the yarn. Wrap the coffee yarn around your fingers like this. Pinch the yarn tail and fabric together like this. In round 41, start with one chain stitch, and then work 9 single crochets, finally end with one slip stitch. One chain stitch is done, and the yarn chain is done. Pull the yarn tail tight. Then work 9 single crochets. Put the yarn tails above the hook during crocheting. Mark the first single crochet and continue to work 8 more single crochets. Four single crochets are done. Stretch the loop and remove the hook. Pull this yarn tail tight. Pull the gray and off right yarns. Put this coffee yarn tail inside the fabric. Wrap the yarn around your fingers again. Put the hook back into the loop and tighten the loop. Continue to work single crochets. Finish 9 single crochets in total. Finally, work one slip stitch in the first stitch to join this round. Round 41 is done. Please finish rounds 42 to 48 in the same way as round 41 by yourself. Work one chain stitch, 9 single crochets, and one slip stitch for each round. Run 48 is done. Stress the loop and remove the hook. Break yarn, leaving the long yarn tail. And pull the yarn tail out. Thread the needle with the yarn tail. A regular stitch has two loops. The loop close to us is the front loop. We can also hold close by stitching through the front loops only of the last round.
Pull the yarn tail tight to close the hole. Fist the yarn tail inside the fabric. We'll use this yarn tail for sewing later. The main body is completed. Please crochet the main body for the other dutchons in the same way with the corresponding yarns on your own.